Hey everyone, today I'm going to be looking at the ETH Bitcoin chart and I know some people are confused about what this is and uh, why it's useful so I'll try to explain it quick. Basically the ETH Bitcoin chart just compares Ethereum's price action to Bitcoin's price action. So for an example, you can see that since about March 9th, the ETH Bitcoin chart has increased by about 9.5%. So that just means that since March 9th, Ethereum has pumped 9.5% more than Bitcoin has. And if you check that, you can see that since March 9th, Bitcoin has gone up about 20%. And if you check Ethereum's price action during that time, it has gone up 29%. So checking not just Ethereum, but any other alt you hold versus Bitcoin is a good idea because you want to make sure that you're not holding something that just bleeds against Bitcoin. You want something that at least oscillates, meaning that sure there can be downtrends where Bitcoin will outperform it, but there can also be uptrends. And you can see that ETH isn't doing too bad since September 2019. It has outperformed Bitcoin by about 355%. And another note, typically if ETH Bitcoin is on the rise, we often see other altcoins making up ground against Bitcoin. And we have actually seen that the past couple days. Some alts haven't been doing too bad. And we did just get this little 10% pump on the ETH Bitcoin chart. And we actually bottomed at a very significant level here. You can see since we broke out of this channel down here, we've been consolidating at the top of the channel in this little triangle formation, or you could even say we are still in some sort of uptrend, maybe forming a new channel on top of this one. This shows that Ethereum still has the potential to continue making up ground against Bitcoin, continue to outperform it. And it seems like we are at a very interesting point right now. The ETH merge is expecting to happen sometime in quarter two, meaning between April and June, which could bring a lot of attention to ETH, but nobody knows what's going to happen with Bitcoin. It is testing the bull market support band. We still don't have any confirmations of it breaking. In fact, we could be rejecting off of it right now. And quarter one is closing in just a couple days so there are a lot of unanswered questions right now is bitcoin going to break above the bull market support band or get rejected but i feel like within the next week or so we're gonna have some more of those questions answered now if ETH bitcoin loses this support level and we end up breaking down back into this channel we do have the potential to drop about 30 35 percent max against bitcoin if we are to stick in this channel here which if that happens could mean one of two things it could either mean that bitcoin pumps really hard leaving alts and ethereum behind or it could mean that everything dumps and ethereum just gets hit harder than bitcoin does but if we are able to maintain this uptrend that eth bitcoin has been on and hold this crucial support we could make a run for some of these targets like this golden pocket up here, which is about 50% above where we are right now. ETH could possibly come up another 2-3% to test the top of this triangle before getting rejected. Or maybe could come up about 30% against Bitcoin to sort of confirm this uptrend channel. A lot of possibilities that could happen. Alright everybody, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please consider leaving a like and subscribing. Really appreciate the support. And I will see you all on Tuesday for my next video. Peace.